Namita Basrotra and in this video I'll be sharing with you one easy shortcut to find LCM of uh, numbers uh, for example let's say in this question I've taken you have six numbers and finding LCM will take time so let's see how we can apply some shortcuts here I presume that you know how to find LCM simply what we do is we write all the numbers here in a line and then we start uh, thinking of a prime number you know what are prime numbers two three five like I've written over here two three five we have to uh, think of a prime number and that prime, prime number should divide at least two of the given numbers here so let's begin and see how we can apply this shortcut here and make this question very very simple we begin with the prime number two but before we begin with the prime number two, as we can see some even numbers here and all, there is one very interesting shortcut I want to teach you. Now what you can do is you will look at the numbers and you will find that if any one number is a factor of any other number in the same line. So when I look at it, I can see that 12 here, can you see? And 108, so 12 is a factor of 108 right so in this case you can simply cancel 12 and there is no need to take it further similarly i have 15 here and 150 here so i can see that 15 is a factor of 150 this you can do it orally and this 12 108 is basically you say the table of table of 12 and you know that 108 comes in the table of 12 like that and you're so when i can see that 15 is a factor of 150 so this factor we will get rid of it so basically you now you're left with only four numbers and this can be done at any time as you uh, proceed with the question so now i can see some even numbers here i start i take uh, a divisor as two it is a prime number so i will write the quotient here i know that 245s are 90 and make half i'll write the quotient of uh, 108 so i get 54 when you divide 108 by 2 you get 54 as a quotient and 135 cannot be divided so in that case i'll write 135 as it is and when i divide 150 by 2 my quotient will be 75 now at each step you try to find out do you have any such number which is a factor of another number so when i look at it i can see that yes 45 is a factor of 135 as 45 into 3 is 135 so that means i can cancel this straight away here uh, and this gets easier isn't it now i will be taking another number which is 3 now i'm left with 54 so let's write the quotient that is 18 right and if we divide 135 by 3, you add it, 5 plus 3 is 8 and plus 1 is 9. So that means it is divisible by 3. When I do that, I and the last is, I know that that it will be 25 by 75. 25 into 3 is 75. After this, we again can take a, a prime number. Shall I take 3 again? Okay. So we know that 3, 6 are 18 and then uh, 15, 3 into 15 is 45 and 25 doesn't come in the table of 3 we can't divide it so i write 25 as it is after this i can take 5 because uh, these uh, both numbers are divisible by 5 so i will write i'll take 6 as it is and 5 3 is, uh, is 15 and then 5 5 is 25 now looking at these three numbers as we know that 3 is a factor of 6 so you can cancel this here itself after this i can see 6 and 5 they are co primes so we can stop over here we just don't need to go any further so what will be the lcm lcm will be the product of all the divisors from here which are 2 into 3 into 3 into 5 the numbers which are left and which are the co primes here which i have written that is into 6 and into 5 when you multiply the product of all these numbers is 2700 so children i'm sure you find this method simple and apply this short method to save your time so this is namita basrotra thank you for watching the video bye bye